Hey guys, game is Akia and welcome to my top 10 PC simulation games to watch in 2015. Now, simulation games can be intricate and immersive and they're getting better. If you're looking for some awesome system building and realistic creations, then I think it's time you simulate some interest in these upcoming titles. First up, we've got Habitat by Forgency. It's a simulation game about building a home in space and surviving the harsh conditions of the cosmos. It's your job to save humankind by assembling space stations, build, upgrade, fly, and fight with space junk on the edge of Earth's orbit. It's got a ways to go in development, so it's time to see if you can manipulate the debris to your advantage or end up crashing and dying. Then we have Cosmonautica by Chasing Carrots. Think of a mix of The Sims and Elite. You control your crew living their lives on a spaceship, traveling in a quirky and humorous universe. Trade, fight, and manage. Stick to the law or become space pirates. The game shows a lot of potential, but it's still being developed, so let's hope they're able to bring this funky vision to life. Next, we have Factorio by Woob Software. A game where you build and maintain factories. You'll be mining resources, researching technologies, building infrastructure, automating production, and fighting enemies. As with any system building game, you use simple pieces to construct complex and ingenious structures. There's multiplayer too. It's still in development, but if you're looking for a grittier version of Transport Tycoon with creatures out to destroy you, check this out. And then we've got Roller Coaster Tycoon World by Pipeworks Software. We've come a long way since Theme Park, and in this construction and management simulation, it brings the roller coaster experience another step forward. Build rides, shops, and coasters while watching your budget, visitor happiness, and technology research. No microtransactions in this one, and you can even expect some multiplayer capabilities like visiting, sharing blueprints, or even four-player co-op. Definitely worth a look. Next up, we've got Take on Mars by Bohemia Interactive. Still in early access and getting some cool features, this game simulates the human struggle to conquer Mars. Manage a space program, control rovers to conduct scientific studies, create custom scenarios and missions, explore various locations, and most recently, multiplayer manned missions. It's still got a long way to go, but we'll see if this becomes a fully functional Mars simulator. Then we have Aquanox Deep Descent by Digital Arrow. With a heritage going back to 1996, this futuristic sub-simulation game is being revived by new developers. Customize your ships and partake in underwater shooting in this dystopian future. There will be co-op, PvP, and some RPG elements too, but the focus really seems to be on making the vehicles themselves fully functional with informative interfaces and realistic controls. Not too much has been seen yet, and it's not by the same devs, so this one could be great or just not live up to expectations. And next we've got Cities Skylines by Colossal Order. Well, if the new SimCity didn't do it for you, here is just the game. City Skylines has all your modern city building needs, boasting huge maps, flowing water, official modding tools and support, and the ever important feature of being able to play offline. There is some concern that this won't feel as sophisticated or refined as past SimCity titles, but we'll have to wait and see how things turn out. Then we have The Universe Sim by Crytivo Games. First and foremost, a planet management game. You are given the powers of a god, unleashing you on the universe and influencing how your civilization evolves, but without direct control, much like managing your own ant farm. Going from the Stone Age to intergalactic endeavors, the game is driven by dynamic events from disasters to behavioral changes. It's an interesting mix of a god game and simulations that really has the potential to be something amazing. Then we have Limit Theory by Procedural Reality. Here we have a vast procedurally generated universe ready to be explored, exploited, and conquered by you. This single-player space simulator brings you an infinite universe and recent devlogs shows extremely customizable on-the-fly modding capabilities. Enjoy your freedom among the stars in this beautiful and atmospheric title. And finally, we've got No Man's Sky by Hello Games. One of the most curious and impressive games of this year, this procedurally generated infinite universe is vibrant and seamless. There is a big focus on exploration and discovering things no one has seen before. Choose whether to share your discoveries with other players as they are exploring the same universe in parallel. Choose how you play the game as you make your way through and around this dangerous yet beautiful cosmos. 
Now, most of these games should be releasing in 2015, but either way, you should keep an eye on developments to see if these games will simulate pure greatness or mere mediocrity. Alright, that wraps up my top 10 PC simulation games to watch in 2015. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, drop me a like or share it with your friends. The support is always appreciated. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.